The number of homes available for sale went up 2.5%. Pending sales are up 1.7%. And the inventory absorption rate is up a smidge. Let's get into it and take a closer look at the Phoenix real estate market. There are 4,613 homes for sale, 25,211 homes sold over the past 90 days. The inventory absorption rate is 16.46 days. The average days on market is 41. The list to sales price ratio is 99.1%. The average home value is $449,459. The value one year ago was $370,747. And the one year increase in value is 17.51%. All right, so what do all these numbers mean? Last week, the inventory absorption rate and the available properties for sale stayed virtually the same as the previous week. But this week, they both went up. It's ever so slight. However, this could mean home sellers are now feeling more comfortable because the pandemic seems to be letting up. It's putting more homes on the market. But this could also be happening because some buyers have been turned off by the multiple offer situations and interest rates went up ever so slightly. Interest rates were just under 3%. Now they're just over. Interest rates are still in historically rare and low territory, so this really shouldn't deter one from buying. I don't foresee multiple offers going away uh, anytime soon here in the Phoenix metro area as we're still having upwards of 226 people move here every day and several companies have also moved their operations here. All right, so what are the trends we're seeing in the marketplace right now? 280 properties per day are selling in the Phoenix metro area. And last week, 3,398 properties were added to the MLS to be sold. At the current rate we are selling homes, it will only take 12 days to put those that were listed last week under contract. This tells us we will still see multiple offers, and each month we'll see the price go up a little bit as well. The inventory absorption rate went up for the first time since October of last year. Some may think that that means Prices will come down, and it's a sign of the housing apocalypse. When in actuality, it's not saying much. Uh, we need to be uh, in the three-month range and rising to even suggest we are entering a balanced or normal market. Historically, five to six months of inventory is considered normal. We are in days of inventory and have a ways to get to months. All right, that's it for this week's market update. Please be sure to like or follow us. Stay safe out there. And if you have any questions about the Phoenix real estate market, you know who to call.